Good evening, my friends. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my beautiful Rideshare Revolutionaries. It's me, Gio, the leader of the Rideshare Revolution, the Rideshare Rockstar, and the captain of the 2K Club. And the real, the funniest, handsomest, and the bearded, list driver on YouTube. And uh, some surprising news coming out of Chicago. This is so far the best week I've ever driven. Absolutely kicking ass out here, making stupid money. Lyft is red hot. Uber is busy. Via is busy. I mean, this this bad weather we've been getting is just just created all this demand out of control. Like. You guys are looking at those numbers today, right? Look at that lift for this week. $301 for eight hours, right? I'm so fucking horrible at math, but that's over $35 an hour on lift. Check that out. That's today. $220 in, let's just say, five and a half hours. That's almost that's almost 40 bucks an hour, is it? No, it's not 40 bucks an hour. I, no, that might be, yeah, that might be close to 40 bucks an hour today. Um, and this, you know, just to highlight how busy all this, this is from just regular lift rides, guys. This is not Lux, this is not XL, this is not, this is not, um, you know, Lux Black, none of that stuff. This is just Lyft. Just absolutely just killing it today. Um, you know, and it's all the stuff I've been saying. You gotta you gotta know your market, you gotta use your filters, you know, and you gotta hustle, you gotta be ready to work. It's not gonna fall in your lap. But this whole week everything has been working out so far. You know, and the other surprising thing is, so I started if you guys want to talk about the total time spent in the car that we could do like 3.15 till 10.30 yesterday. So that was, let's just say 7.25 hours. And then 12.15 till about 6.30. So that's, It's like 13 and a half hours. Then today I started at 4.15. So 4.15 till about 10. So that was 5 hours and 45 minutes. So that's 19.25 hours. And then today uh, in the afternoon I got some lunch with some of my revolutionaries. Two of my two of my 2K club members right there. Mike and, Mike and uh, Dave. Uh... And I think I turned the app on around 1.30, and I just stopped, and I, well, I'm driving home right now. So that's six hours. So right there, I've been in the car, total time I've spent in this car driving, uh, 25, let's just, if we round up, 26 hours. So I've, I got about 22 hours on, on all three apps, because I also did one hour via today for 50 bucks. Um, Because <clears throat> that's something a lot of you guys always do. Yeah, you're in your car all fucking day. Yeah. So there you go. 13 hours on, on app on Uber. 8 hours on Lyft. 1 hour on Via. So got about 22 hours total on app. And total time I've spent driving this week, 26 hours. And... I've only driven 340 miles this week. Absolutely fucking killing it. I'm at 740 something dollars. I'm already positive $400 versus against miles driven in two days. Right? Check this out. Check out this screenshot. This was this morning. 250% on a Tuesday. <coughs> Lyft is on fire. But also, like, it's... 
like and like I tell everyone, you need you need both apps to maximize maximize earnings. The last two mornings, Lyft was the better options to was the better option to make money in Chicago. But in the afternoon, Uber was was providing steady pings. You know, so I got like when I turned my app back on after I got lunch, I was doing a bunch of short rides on Uber. I'm talking about like super short rides. Like I did eight rides that probably all equaled less than 10 miles. All of them, including drive, driving to the passenger. <coughs> like the week I'm having right now, I don't think there's any select drivers that can do this. You know, if you just, you know, even on their best week, this is just, these numbers are out of control. Um, and I'm just taking full advantage. Like yesterday I woke up three o'clock in the morning. Today I woke up 3.55 in the morning. And I'm still not feeling well. <coughs> you gotta, you gotta take advantage of the demand when it's there, guys. You know. I know so many of you still, you're not big fans of Uber and Lyft and all that stuff, but if you're trying to maximize earnings in a big market, in a major market, when it's when it's this busy, you got to be out there. It's not going to fall in your lap. It will not fall in your lap. You need to get out there. You got to hustle. You got to, you got to have your market mastered. And when you do, you're going to, you're going to capitalize on these big weeks. If everything goes well, I might hit 2K before Saturday. That's how the that's how out of control this week has been. If I make $300 tomorrow, $300 on Thursday, and I hit Quest, that'll put me like very close to $1,500 for four days. <coughs> if I have a huge Friday, then I'll hit, you know, I'll hit Quest before before the Saturday Saturday even rolls around I mean I'm going to hit 2k pretty much guaranteed this week but you know this is the best start to my I mean before this the best start to my week I had was $700 in two days um, right now I'm at like 745 so you know all this like I did get lucky with one ride today I was downtown I think this might have been right before I took that ride. So I was downtown, and I was running Lyft, and I was getting all these pings, but I wanted to go back up north to get a nice lengthy ride coming back to the city. So I set my filter for uptown, which is, as you guys can see up there, on Lyft, and luckily I got a 200% prime time going to, uh, to Lakeview. So that one ride, which took me in the direction I wanted to go, that ride paid me 25 bucks for like... 16 minutes or something <coughs> everything just worked out you know and these passengers I haven't been getting bad ratings or anything all these passengers are super grateful for you know at least they happened to me which and probably happened to other drivers because you know it was snowing like crazy yesterday it was cold as hell today but we show up in a nice warm clean car and we get them to work nice and safe and sound and and happy and there's no there's no conflict there's no drama it's you know we're doing we're doing what we're supposed to be doing and but they're having to pay extra that's just how it works when it's this out of control when it's this busy when mother nature's kicking the shit out of us it's gonna it's gonna you know if you want to play you gotta pay you know or you gotta pay if you want to play either, either, either way you say it <coughs> That's all I got, guys, for this one. Uh, yeah, just if you guys are in a major market and you're affected by some of these deep freezes going on, you're probably making a killing, too. Maybe not Wisconsin. One of my subscribers told me they're just getting pounded with snow right now, so everything's shut down. But here in Chicago, man, best week ever. You know, I, I really didn't think it was going to be this crazy, but I'm, I'm thankful it is. So... Yeah, that's all I got for this one, guys. Uh, I want to thank y'all for watching. If you're if you're driving this weather, everyone, please be careful. If you if your heater doesn't work, stay home. Uh, tomorrow's gonna be a record-breaking cold. It might be one of the coldest days ever recorded in Chicago. But 
everyone like don't don't risk it if you don't feel like it. If you if you don't feel comfortable driving in that kind of condition, don't do it. <coughs> As for me, I'm gonna be out here. So everyone, uh, take care out there. Everyone, please stay safe, stay driven, stay classy. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye bye.